What's going on? It's your boy Stash here, owner of Stash Heels Custom Jigs. Uh, today we're going to be doing a quick tutorial on screw lock weights and how to do them with the do it mold. Uh, I have it right here, just heating up on top of my pot, get it nice and warm, and uh, heat it up. So going to show you a few of the things we're just going to be using. I have my rod here. It's my custom rod. It is not the original, but it is my custom rod. The original snapped after numerous and a lot of punch jigs. So it was time for it to go so I have that there, and then I have my screw lock weights. Not my screw lock weights, but my screw locks. So I think this is pretty warm. You can just feel it by temp holding the handle. So what I have here is a um, split jig. Uh, that's what they call it on here, but I call it punch weight, punch jig. Uh, big difference from a uh, punch jig itself. Any heavyweight jig would be something to punch through, but these are straight through punch jigs. Uh, no tangles, no weeds, straight to the bottom. I love them. Number one choice. A lot of anglers do not use them, but I do, and I sell them, I make them, and I try to put them out there for more people to use them. <clears throat> so check me out, Stashio's Custom Jigs. So right now, we're just going to get this ready. So I have my uh, rod here, lead here, nice and hot, spooling out pretty good. So what I'm going to do here. All I'm doing is slipping on the screw lock. So there it is. And choice of making, I seen Tiger Warehouse coming out with them now. Uh, they've been out for a while. A lot of people don't use them, but I still use them. I love them. Uh, I get a few people that do want them, but now that Tackle Warehouse is selling them, you know how that goes, the bandwagon, and whew, but not me. So I'm just here making them. I use them for my personal use, uh, selected customers that I have, and um, they work great. So I placed it in there. <clears throat> it has six different molds in there. Um, right now I'm using the one fourth, and um, just gonna get that ready. So I have my torch here. I just like to heat it up. Uh, heat the rod up. So I do not place the screw lock all the way into the hole. Just the shaft with the hook part. This way you get more of the screw lock part on. So I have it there. I don't know if you can see, but just gonna fill that up. I could do all six, but just gonna show you. I don't wanna drag this video on. I don't know how that could be. So just quick tutorial. So we're gonna open that up. And voila, we have our screw lock. Just gonna unwind that off. Let's cool it off so that you can touch it. <clears throat> so I'm gonna snip this off. Voila, there's screw lock. 
warm weight. There it is. Um, get a plastic bait real quick. I don't know why I didn't put that on before, but I don't know if I have one there. Let me see. Even better, I have me a Damakiki swim body. And there it is. I don't even think it could get any perfect than that. Screw lock is not coming off. It's not coming off. Best believe. Uh, it's a great product. Definitely guarantee it. But you're going to see Tackle Warehouse with them. I have them out. You can check me out. Stash Hills Custom Jigs. S T A S H E O. S, don't forget the S, Stachios, Custom Jigs, check me out, there it is, screw lock, unscrew, unscrew, can't get no better than that, so there it is, quick tutorial,